Mr. President, it's wonderful to see you again and, uh, here in your own hometown. The, uh, and thank you for hosting the G7 Summit here. So under Japan's leadership, we've already delivered progress on the G7 agenda this year, and I'm looking forward to our meetings in the days ahead. As you said back in January when you were at the White House, I think the quote is, we face the most, one of the most complex environments in recent history, security environments. And uh, I couldn't agree with you more. But I'm proud that the United States and Japan are facing it together. And, uh, you know, we stand up for the shared values, including supporting the great people of Ukraine as they defend their sovereign territory, and holding Russia accountable for its new aggression. And, uh, we're tracking the global challenges from strengthening our community and our commitment to uh, nuclear non-proliferation to ensuring a free and open Indo-Pacific. That's at the heart of all this. And, uh, you know, we're, it seems to me we're, we're, we're deepening our cooperation on emerging technologies, including, uh, including new partnerships between the United States and Japanese companies, and as you mentioned, universities as well. In, area, in areas like quantum computing and semiconductors. And I want to thank you uh, for Japan's commitment to increase investment in these areas. The bottom line, Mr. Prime Minister, is that uh, when our countries stand together, we stand stronger. And I believe the whole world is safer when we do. So thank you again for having me here today. We look forward to the next seven days. Thank you very much. Mr. President, can you hear me?